Book News and we're down here at Computex 2010 and we are outside and it's not as sunny as we'd hoped because today we're looking at the Pixel, Pixel Qi screen technology. So it is Pixel QI. Now we're going to hold up the Nexus One which has an OLED screen and as you can see the viewing angle on the screen not so good. So this is actually one of the first times we're seeing uh, Pixel Qi with a touch screen integrated onto the screen. Uh, at CES, they were saying uh, that you know touch screen dulls the colors and all this kind of stuff, but we're glad to see that they actually went towards the touch screen direction because, well, that's just the future. And the, the thing that John was showing you there with the viewing angles is uh, quite, quite improved from, from the uh, screen that we were seeing in CES. Um, Mirasol has recently come out with their screen technology and they just showed it at D8 the other day. Let's maximize this. Let's see. Let's see what we have going on here. Oh, there we go. So we'll just play this movie while I chat. So Mirasol has actually come out with their display technology uh, at D8 just yesterday. And uh, the Marisol technology, to me, was just, it was astounding. The, the, the vibrancy of colors and how amazing just the, the color saturation seemed. And when I was comparing that to what I was seeing here with Pixel Chi at CES, uh, with the viewing angles, I immediately said that Mirasol was one of my top favorites. But seeing Mirasol yesterday at the D8, uh, no one could touch it, no one could see it. I actually have this here in my hands outside, so this is way more ready for uh, press to, uh, to fondle and play with it, which is a good thing to see. And we're, we're, we're actually going to try to dispel a couple of rumors that I've heard here in Taiwan as well. Um, one of the rumors was that the, the reason why the Notion Inc. wasn't coming out was that the Pixel Chi screen technology wasn't ready and that it was the screen that was holding up uh, the production. But we're hearing that it's really just more of, of, a, of an OEM, ODM issue that um, Notion Inc. is having. This is what the people from Pixel Chi are telling us, that it's not them. So. We hope we might we may have put that rumor to bed. We're not sure. It may still pop up, but the proof will be in the pudding. So we we will you know just be looking to see this device come out after Computex because we're being told right now that this amazing screen technology will be out after Computex. And just uh, one quick technical note, I guess uh, this runs at 0.4 in black and white mode, so that's significantly lower than. Uh, Mirasol, which runs at 2.5. Uh, they run at 2.5 across the board, which means that in full color mode, Mirasol will run at 2.5. Uh, what, what, what does Mirasol run uh, in full color with, with, uh, with the backlight on? The screens that? We're not sure. Okay. So full, full, full screen color, but in power saving mode, Pixel Chi does come out on top. Just, we would love to see this come out to the industry. We think it's really important that we have screens that we can use outside. The screen is the one thing that really does draw the power because this, this here on the back, this isn't getting better. Battery life's not improving. Everyone keeps on saying that batteries are going to be improving, but they don't. 1%, 2%, who really cares? Fix the screen and maybe we'll have a portable product. So I'm Nicole Scott for Next Book, Netbook News looking at Pixel Chief.